Hey guys, it's Paul. I want to give you a really quick introduction today to F.Lux uh, over at jet, justgetflux.com. Uh, it's an app for your computer and your phone that um, controls the lighting display and, and makes it different at different times of night. Um, you'll see every notice you uh, people texting at night, there's an eerie blue glow or wake up to ready to write down the next great idea and get blinded by your computer. During the day, your computer screens look good. They're designed to look like the sun. But at 9 p.m., 10 p.m. or 3 a.m., you probably shouldn't be looking at the sun. So it alters the brightness level um, and the, you know, the, I guess the flux of your computer, right? I've been using it for two weeks. I really like it. Uh, just before I dive in, it's really good for me in these videos. This is a, uh, it's actually late 2019, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tag it as uh, F.Lux 2020 introduction because we're nearly in 2020. Um Tell me why you're here. Tell me where you came from to get to this video. Uh, and if I've got any other videos that I can share with you or there's any other softwares that I recommend that you might be looking for, uh, I will reply to you. So just pause me and tell me why you're here. It does me a big favor. Thanks. So all you're going to do is you're going to install it, right? So obviously I download, um, I download it for uh, Mac. I've got a Mac. Obviously, if you were, uh, I have donated $10 because I use it. I've just donated it, actually. Um, by downloading it, you agree, uh, there's a Windows version, there's an iOS version that you can click on, uh, and then you've got to click, you're going to have to, oh, to install Flux, how do I jailbreak my device, oh god, I, I don't sure I'd, I'd recommend you jailbreaking your phone, um, but putting it on your computer is really easy, I haven't looked at the point on my phone, because I don't use my phone at night, I'm not a big tech, well like I WhatsApp, I've just turned it off, I WhatsApp on my computer, but when it's loaded, what it'll do at 8 o'clock at night, it will uh, change. Set time and date. Can I turn this off? Let me just, let's see. Uh, let's see if I can change the time and show you. See how it went dark. So when it knows it's dark at night time, so it'll be... As, as it goes into dusk, it knows your time zone and it's going to make your computer go darker. So you get this less hazy effect behind, right? So as it, and as it gets darker, it goes even darker. So when what it's saying is when you, like say, if you've got a good idea at three o'clock in the morning when you wake up, you open your computer, you don't blind everybody in your bedroom, everybody, I don't sure how many people are there, um, and you can just jump in and it doesn't really hurt your eyes. And it's, it's adjusting the light for the time of day and then as it gets into whatever time you set it for the morning oh it's going to start to brighten up look 7 30 it's brightening up if that's full brightness and you're back into your time so in the morning it's brighter when you're ready for the sun right so it almost makes your computer work as the sun does and i like it because i i sit on my computer i'm always tinkering i'm watching the tv um, um, doing my work and it, I feel it as well you feel your eyes getting sore you feel your and if you don't have settings to change um, that you do yourself it's, it's just you're just going to blind yourself with the light especially when you turn the lights off and you're sat in the dark it's going to be too bright for you isn't it so there's other effects as well there's a movie if you're sat in a dark room you can change it so there's a dark room effect. So, you know, it's a bit weird for me at the minute because I'm not in a dark room. But it changes it a lot. Dark rooms till sunrise, right? Or you can go in and colour effect movie mode. If you're watching a movie, it just takes a little bit of the edge off the movie. It's going to let you watch a movie for two and a half hours. Then it's going to revert back to how you use it. So I watch a lot of movies in bed. Go Like anybody, you, you do your work, you go in. I ain't got a TV up there. So laptop on, on the bed or the side table. And it just takes the edge of it. I don't use movie mode. I actually just let it work in the darker version. But that takes a little bit of the, the movie um, slant off it. So it's really easy. Preferences you can change. You know, you can change up here when I wake up. So I put 8 a.m. But if you wake up later, you can, can make it darker till later. If you work a, a late shift, you can change the time. You know, sunset. Choose a night colour. So you can change it around with the brightness. What do you want it to be at, at night? Do you want it to be this dark? You know, bedtime. Do you want it to be this dark? It hurts your eyes, and it doesn't hurt your eyes. It's a little bit of a 
and if it's a bit brighter at bedtime, daytime, you want it to be normal, right? So it's up to you how light or dark you want it when you wake up, when you go to bed. Uh, I should go recommended colours, classic bar. So you'll see it's going to know what time zone, it's going to know what time sunset is, it's going to know what time it's going to sunrise. Uh, there's not a lot to change in it, there's not a lot of messing about. I don't touch it. You can obviously turn it off and do things with it. Uh, but I find it really easy. It's really easy to use. And like I say, you know, when that clock changes, as you as you go through your day, as you go through your night, it's definitely helping me. It's helping possibly with uh, sleep uh, and things like that. It's starting to, to just ease yourself into the night. Um, there we go. I was up here, right? So you imagine if I go back to changing this, Yes, yes. As, as you've shown you already, as it gets later, it knows it's getting darker in Britain or wherever you are, and it's going to ease it into a night, right? And it just takes the edge off your eyes. It just takes the edge off. Uh, oh. You get it. I've already done this, Hunter. It just takes a little bit more off. Um, the stress and strain in your eyes forever looking at a white screen, which, like it says, it's like the sun. There's obviously more research. Look into it. You can buy light bulbs for your house that do it as well. There's a forum if you've got any problems. Uh, and, like I say, if you go to looks, uh, about looks, uh, check for updates. I don't know what I've just seen. Uh, donate. I think I opened it. Oh, support. Support F dot looks and you can go and it's just going to say ten dollars, but you can probably change this to five or ten thousand. I'm sure they'd be happy with you if you want to say that. You know, I'll go send them send five dollars if it helps. You know, I just sent them ten bucks. I'm sure, you know, uh, for me, I use it a lot. I've used it every night and I, and I really enjoy that when it comes on that I see that screen going down. So hopefully this was a quick introduction and it gives you. Uh, you know, a little bit of interesting in downloading looks. Any questions, comments, leave them below. I will reply to you. Come and visit me, paulnicholson.com, for other app training. There probably won't be any training in this because there's not anything to do with it. Uh, but there's a forum there that you can ask. I'll show you. Paul Nicholson for training. And then there's a forum for any other questions you've got on the platforms you use. Have a great day. See you soon. Thanks.